If you're installing a zombie lock with your system, determine which method, bolts or tube gate brackets, you'll be using to mount the zombie lock to your gate. If you're using the tube gate brackets, it's very important that you do not remove the nuts at the base of the brackets. These have been put in place to prevent the bracket from being screwed too deeply into the zombie lock, which may cause damage. Determine which of the screw holes in the zombie lock will be used to attach the bolts or clamps and attach them to the zombie lock. If possible, the zombie lock should be mounted on the same rail or at the same level as the operator on the other end of the gate. While holding the zombie lock in place, determine the position of the receiver bracket and mark holes for drilling. Pre-drill holes in the post and attach the receiver bracket. Fine-tune the position of the zombie lock and tighten the clamps. Use zip ties or some other method to run the zombie lock wire to the control board. Locate the proper terminal on the control board and connect the zombie lock wires to the board. Please refer to the installation manual of the zombie lock for specific details. Once the lock has been installed, turn the system off and then back on. This will activate the locking system. If, for any reason, it becomes necessary to disconnect the zombie lock, then you should disconnect all zombie lock wires from the control board. Then turn the power off on the control box. Hold both jog buttons down simultaneously, and while holding the buttons, turn the power back on. Wait for the beeps before releasing the jog buttons. This will deactivate the locking system as though no lock had been installed. The key supplied with the zombie lock system will also override the lock. This video is designed to be used in conjunction with the installation manual, which contains detailed diagrams, information, and illustrations not shown in this video. The manual also contains a list of tools and other items you may need for proper installation. Please refer to the installation manual when installing your system.